Hello, I'm Juliette Sali. In this week's edition of IG Macro Intelligence, we take a look at the outlook for the healthcare sector in 2024. The Australian healthcare sector rose less than 3% over the past 12 months, but analysts are confident of a better year of returns in 2024. Shares in the Australian Healthcare Index are currently trading above the 20-day moving average and are 6.7% above the 200-day moving average, according to Comsec data, showing strength within a longer-term bearish trend. Population growth, particularly the growing ageing population, is a reason the Motley Fool reckons healthcare will start to outperform as more potential patients boost revenue and earnings. Meanwhile, the healthcare sector is adopting new technology and AI, which underpin the tech sector's outperformance in 2023. The adoption is expected to address issues such as staff shortages and burnout, as well as patient safety and care. Healthcare stocks are seen as a defensive position amidst troubled economic times. High interest rates often see investors flock to the safety of bonds, which can affect the valuation of healthcare stocks. The Azempic effect has also weighed negatively on the outlook for some healthcare companies like ResMed. The medical equipment company was targeted by short sellers late last year, concerned that if there are fewer obese people, demand for its CPAP sleep apnea machines would wane. This is a claim the ResMed CEO Mick Farrell has shrugged off multiple times, telling Ausbiz recently the rumours and the market were wrong. In fact, ResMed reported solid earnings growth of 12.5% in the second quarter to US$1.16 billion US dollars amid its expanding global presence. Most analysts are bullish on ResMed's outlook, according to data collected by FN Arena. Aude Manesh is most positive on the stock, with a price target of $39 per share, implying a 35% upside from its current price. The company is also benefiting from a blow dealt to its main rival, the Dutch firm Philips, which has revealed it will not be selling its new sleep apnea machines in the key US market, while it works to resolve an issue with the Food and Drug Administration. City expects this will be a positive catalyst for ResMed's earnings. It has a buy rating and a price target of $34. Meanwhile, market heavyweight CSL was also impacted by the so-called Azempic effect late last year. In October, shares hit a four-year low of $228. City has a buy on the stock and the stock last hit an all-time high of $340 in 2020. UBS thinks it can reach this milestone again. CSL will report half-year results on February 13. Elsewhere, analysts are mostly upbeat on the outlook for medical diagnostics firm Sonic Healthcare, which has slumped around 8% over the last six months. City recently upgraded the stock to a buy. Macquarie has a neutral rating and Audmanet classifies the stock as a hold. Morgan's is most bullish with a price target of $36.55 and an ad rating. The broker thinks the company is well positioned for growth thanks to cost reduction initiatives. And that is your IG Macro Intelligence for this week. We'll see you next week.